This man constructed a water dam upon a small stream, one that effectively mimics the larger dams. He chose the location and then proceeded to level it. He brought two plastic pipes and carefully placed soil over them, establishing a central base for the dam's construction. After that, he poured the cement concrete onto this base and also across the entire foundation, meticulously smoothing it out. The man brought in the necessary cement and bricks to initiate the primary construction phase of the dam. During the entire construction process, the man deliberately created and left specific openings within the structure, which were intended to function as future gates for the dam, thereby allowing for the eventual passage of water. The man was diligent in smoothing the exterior of the structure, ensuring it resembled a concrete dam designed to emulate the grand scale of larger dams. Following this, the man proceeded to construct the front bays along the dam's facade. This base would eventually serve as the pathway for the dam's gates, of which there would be two. Then he began smoothing its exterior with a layer of concrete to protect it and give it an outer shape that makes the dam appear truly realistic. After that, he constructed the pyramidal passage through which the water will eventually flow once the gates are opened later on. The man proceeded to divide the main pathway into four distinct lanes. He then carefully marked and meticulously leveled each one. His intention was to ensure the surface of these lanes was smooth, facilitating the swift passage of water later on. The man completed the preparation of the pathways, ensuring they were securely fastened. He then poured concrete over the dam's upper surface, making it more robust and resilient against the water's pressure, and carefully leveled its outer face. Subsequently, he began making arrangements for the construction of a secondary access path alongside the dam. This bypass will be used later on to divert the excess water so its force does not affect the dam's construction in the future. Once the man had finished his initial tasks, he commenced the installation of the sturdy metallic dam gates and subsequently integrated a remote control system for their operation. Following this, he proceeded to close the main water pipe thereby initiating the crucial process of water retention, before finally conducting a thorough and comprehensive test of the dam's functionality. After he had impounded the water, and the water level had gradually risen until it reached the very top of the dam's structure, the man began to open the gate slowly, and the water started to flow out gradually, until its momentum and volume began to significantly increase. It appeared that the entire concept was both brilliant and highly successful. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and activate the notification bell to get all new updates.